the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good night message on this Wednesday, the 27th of October 2021, broadcasting from the Salesian Pontifical University, Roma, Italy, by your servant Father Eustace Siame, a Salesian of Don Bosco. We listen to this encouraging message in line with the first reading of today, entitled, All Things Work Together for Good. Today we read from Romans chapter 8 verse 26 to 30 and here we came face to face with the anthem of daily bread good night messages. It is like the focus of all the good night messages that we have knowing that there is good in everything that we go through in our lives no matter how terrible our situation might be God is achieving something good but we have to understand that this passage is not just left to end at all things work together for good no Saint Paul says and we know that for those who love God for those who love God I repeat all things work together for good for those who are called according to his purpose. So the promise that is made here is not for everyone. It is only for those who love God. You may be going through something and maybe you have never even thought about God. You go through some painful moment in your life. And then you come and say, this is what is happening to me. I don't know why it's happening. Yes, I don't go to church. Yes, I don't pray. Yes, I don't even do anything divine. I don't do any devotional. But you know what? The promise of all things work together for good is given not to everyone, not for everyone, but for those who love God who are called according to his purpose. That's why there is a difference between a believer and a non-believer going through the same situation. We have all gone through and perhaps continue going through COVID-19. We have all been either infected or affected because our family members have had their lot and some of us have even lost our family members because of this COVID-19. We have all gone through luck at one point or another. Some of us have ended up even losing our jobs. But I want to tell you, if you are a believer, if you love God, if you are called according to his purpose, meaning baptized and able to live a life of one who knows God, who loves God in your life, you are going to see that these experiences that have come as a result of COVID-19 won't be just for nothing. God is working out something behind the scenes. God is making sure that everything works for good. You may have been divorced and somebody who doesn't know God may have been divorced but your experience is different from the other person who doesn't know God. You have always to look at the good side of your experience. You might have lost a job and another person has lost a job who doesn't know God. The experience is different. That's why we must fight to make sure God becomes everything in our lives. Because when God becomes everything in your life, you will never go into depression. 
those people who get into depression are they that do not know God are they that do not love God you know what it means when you find the love of your life you will make sure that you communicate with your love you will make sure that you find time to get in touch with your beloved that is prayer for us if we love god we are going to spend time in prayer because that is where we meet him and that is where he explains to us what he wants to achieve in whatever we are going through all things work together for good for those who love him who are called according to his purpose the promise mind you is not for everyone this promise is for those who love god I am telling you if God doesn't make any sense in your life I am telling you if you have not made God the love of your life somebody you consult somebody you get in touch with at every moment of your life start today and when you make it like that you are going to start seeing that everything works indeed for good in your life Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good night, as it dreams. Same to you, Father. Are beyond my control. To you, Lord, I lift up my soul.